the Vectra Cognito Stream app for Splunk and its add-on allow two important things. The app allows the analyst to easily navigate through the different network metadata collected by the Cognito platform across the network. Where the add-on allows to normalize the metadata into the different Splunk data models we support. The app covers three different use cases, compliances, investigation, and thread hunting. The navigation bar at the top allows to navigate between the different dashboards. Each of them has been built to accelerate the investigation process by providing a set of predefined visualization intended to help the security analyst in his job. Let's look at a couple of them. First, the security dashboard. It allows to quickly identify potential security risk in your network. From exposed RDP and SMB servers from the internet to unencrypted protocols or even identifying Raspberry devices in your network, it can highlight security risk you were not even aware of with great details. Then, a specialized dashboard is pre-built for each metadata type Vectra Cognito Stream supports. Connection, DNS, HTTP, TLS, Certificate, Kerberos, and so on. Let's just take a look at DNS for the example. All the dashboards are built in the same way. A set of filters you can configure before loading the dashboard and a set of custom visualization which provide different angles to look at the metadata. Each view can help identifying a suspect behavior. It could be volume base, query types, length, etc. Some visualization use additional lookups or processing performed by Splunk, like counting the number of subdomain per domain, looking up for open DNS servers, or filtering out the results with Alexa top 1 million list. This saves an enormous amount of time to the security analyst. Let's look at the other special dashboard available in this app. There are three available under the Analyze menu. The single host analyzer provides a 360 view of a host across all the metadata. The single session analyzer provides an in-depth view of a specific session. Then, the internal IP lookup allows you to quickly identify which host is behind an IP address at a certain point of time. We are going to go through a quick scenario where I would like to know which host was behind the IP address 192.168.40.32 during the last seven days. It's obvious that the host named G Hancock PC was behind this IP. A simple click on that host will open a new tab to the host view. Here we can find all the detailed information about this host during that period of time. Volume of data inbound and outbound, number of session, privilege score, top services, long session, DNS query, Kerberos traffic, etc. etc. From each of those tables you see here, you can drill down this host for a certain metadata type and continue your investigation. Here we are going to pivot into the SMB metadata view for this specific host. The Vectra Cognito Stream app enable quick investigation and thread hunting within Splunk across all the metadata and enriched metadata provided by the Vectra Cognito platform. Thank you for listening.